What's up, YouTube? This is Bystand at XMA9. Alright, guys, today we're going to be covering three new Lick Monsters that have been revealed for the OCG Link Reigns Pack 3. Alright, last time we covered the Five Headed Link Dragon, the Endominium Link Monster, as well as the new Predator Link Monster. This time around, we're going to be getting a Buster Blader, a Rose Dragon, and even a World Legacy Link Monster. So let's take a closer look at the three new ones that were revealed. Guys, keep in mind that this set is supposed to be dropping on November 23rd in the OCG, so we hopefully should be getting a lot more information about this set coming this week, and hopefully in the week following and before its release. So, first and foremost, we got Crossroads Dragon. All right, it is a Dark Dragon Link Effect Monster. All right, Link 2 with the arrows of left and bottom, all right? Requires two monsters with different types, which is really generic. All right, you can use these cards first and second effect once per turn. First effect during the main phase, quick effect. You can tribute this card to one plant monster you control, special summon one rose synchro monster or one plant synchro monster from your extra deck. This is treated as a synchro summon. All right, the fact that you can get a rose synchro monster onto the field means you have another way to get black rose dragon on your field during your opponent's turn to nuke the board. Alright, so side frames aren't the only deck that can do that now. Alright, any deck that can get this can utilize this card can actually do have that board nuke available. Alright, second effect. If this monster you control is destroyed by a card effect while this card is in your graveyard, you can banish this card from your graveyard, special summon one rose dragon monster from your graveyard. Alright. With the proper setup, you can get off Black Rose Dragon's second effect, which is actually pretty cool. Alright, next card, companion, rope, destruction swordsman. White Dragon, Link Effect, Link 2 with only 400 attack. Uh, bottom left, bottom right arrows, the best arrows for a Link 2. You can only use this card's first to second effects once per turn each. If this card is Link Summon, it, you can send one Destruction Sword card from your deck to the graveyard and then Special Summon one Buster Blader monster from your hand. Very good. It gets the big guy on the field real fast. All right. Number two, at the end of the battle phase, if your opponent controls no monsters, you can target one of your Buster Blader monsters that did not declare an attack during this turn and inflict damage to your opponent equal to his attack. So it gives you a little access to some burn damage, which is pretty cool. Not bad. Last one, we have World Keymaster Lib. All right, Light Cyber's Link Effect Monster, Link 2, 2,000 attack. Pretty good attack for Link 2, all right? Arrows are left and bottom left. Alright, not loving the arrows. Cannot be Link Summon unless there is a World Legacy card in your graveyard, and you can only use this card's first and second effects once per turn each. Okay, so this has a condition before you can get it out. Okay, during your main phase, you can set one World Legacy spell or trap directly from your deck to your field, but you cannot activate that card during this turn unless you have a World Legacy monster in your graveyard, which is not going to be an issue since you need a World Legacy card in your graveyard to be able to link some of this card out. So, okay. Number two, if this card is linked, some card is sent to the graveyard as a link material, excuse me. All right, so if it's used as a link material, you can shuffle one card on the field into the deck. All right, so that's actually a pretty good effect um, when you're going up the link ladder. So, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of liking this card. And this requires any two monsters. Super generic, can, yeah, can easily be utilized. It's super generic, cybers, move, can, and can easily just turn around and be able to move up that link ladder and actually could help control the field. This is actually a pretty good card. I'm liking this card. All right, so that's it for the three cards they revealed. Now, like, like I said, November 23rd is when this set drops, so hopefully we'll be getting more information about this set this week or early next week. Okay. Going forward, we have the Link Frames Pack Rumors, all right? So we got Buster Blader off the list, okay? We got the Predator Plant and the Minium. We got the Plant Type deck, which is the Rose. We got the Link Dragon, and then the one Link Monster that was missing was the World Legacy. So pretty much it looks like this, this particular leak list is holding accurate. I can't wait to turn around and see what we're going to get for Sky Striker. Tenny or and Mega Phantom Beast. Um, even Artifact is something interesting that, that's going to be um, done with. So, 
can't wait to see what the rest of the cards are going to be like. Guys, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more content like this on my channel, make sure to subscribe. Enable the notifications so you don't miss a single upload. Check out the description box below. Find it invite link to my Discord server. Join a conversation. We would love to have you. Follow me on Twitter at ByStandardX79. And guys, until next time, as always, peace.